like an appetizer, I'd say. Don't make fun of Timmy now. <laughs> Stop the bear with more fire. What do you think I'm trying to do? Spirits of darkness, spirits of bile, renew Tabitha's powers ever so vile. <sighs> Rusty. I'm afraid our situation is a little more dire than that, Timmy. My powers are, in a word, zilch. But how could that be? You had them only a few minutes ago. That's what I feared. Miguel must have survived that avalanche somehow. He must still be alive. Oh, oh don't worry, Timmy. Tabitha won't let anything hurt you. Oh, well, she, she hopes she won't. Is that true, Princess? Or Jimmy and his princess too quick for the cranky old bear? No, but he doesn't know that. You've still got all your parts, haven't you, Timmy? Jimmy thinks so. Jimmy would like to go now. Yes. Well, that makes two of us. We may not be so lucky next time he takes a swipe at us. Uh, tell the can't let Jimmy be bear food. Tell the both for Jimmy, doesn't she? That may be. But if we're going to get out of here alive, you're going to have to be a very brave boy. You're going to make a smashing little decoy. Decoy? The bear will tear to me to shreds. The bear will fall for it to me. Turn it into sawdust. Don't be so dramatic, Timmy. You, know, you may lose an arm or a leg, but I can always sew you a new one. That's what you said last time. And Timmy's new leg has never been as good as the original. Hush up! Listen, you, you've got to be courageous. Like Mel Gibson in Braveheart. We've got to do something to distract him and you're the only thing that's handy. Don't worry. I'll grab whatever's left of you on my way out. <laughs> now, listen, just, just think of it as, as practice for Fluffy. If you can handle a bear... Well, then you can hold your own with a harmless house cat, right? There's no way Tabitha can compare a 10,000 pound grizzly bear with a fluffy. I can see you're going to need a little push. was there and you don't know any karate. The bear fell down because I stuck my foot out and tripped him. Whatever princess needs to believe, the Jimmy knows in his hearts of hearts, it was Jimmy's slick smooth that brought old Smokey down. That bear was no match for Jimmy. Ah, well, in that case, you won't mind going back in there and repeating one of your slick moves, will you? Huh? Uh, 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 that's okay, Princess. Timmy's going to be leaving now. Oh, damn it. I was right. Miguel's alive and he's with charity. How the hell did he escape that avalanche? I was certain that my plan was foolproof. No offense, Tabby. But Jimmy's had enough of her plans. He's already been locked up in a mental ward, trapped by an avalanche, and almost killed by a bear! And that's just in the past couple of weeks. Listen, you, if you're going to uh, tick off a list of my shortcomings, I can easily sew myself another doll, a cheery, grateful doll. Don't get mad at Jimmy, Princess. 
Timmy just needs a break. He needs a vacation to help the problem with Timmy. He needs to go someplace warm. Sip his more Timmy's on a nice sandy beach. And say for Tabitha, you're never going to get rid of Miguel. And Charity's never, ever coming over to the dark side. Maybe you're right, Timmy. Maybe I am a total failure. Timmy didn't say that. No, you didn't say it, but that's what you meant. I'm all washed up. Well, maybe that isn't so bad, Princess. What? Timmy just means that life is passing to me until the bye. Well, he and his princess keep trying out different schemes to get Charity to kill Miguel. <sighs> Maybe it's time to throw on the towel. Call it a day. Cash in the 401k and go in for early retirement. Did you hear that, Tim Tim? <sighs> now Tim really wants to go away. Heart is broken into two. <sighs> Jimmy doesn't stand a chance if Charity loves Miguel. I'm not talking about your broken heart. Things are far worse now than they were before. Jimmy doesn't understand. Oh, that's the understatement of the year. Charity and Miguel have declared their love for one another. They're getting more serious and involved by the minute. Next thing you'll be making love. And you know what that means. Uh-huh. Jimmy can't say he does. It means that Charity will come into her full powers. And then we're lost. No more Martinis. No white sandy beaches. No more us. We can't let that happen, Timmy. 